Hello and welcome to this NHP webinar being an introduction to utilization categories for Switchgear. My name is Ron Pryor and I'm a product specialist and technical training leader for NHP Electrical Engineering Products. In this presentation, we give an introduction to utilization categories for switching applications of low voltage switch gear and control gear. The goal of this presentation is to cover the following points for an understanding of why we have utilization categories, the standards applicable to the different switch gear, and the categories for the different load types. The selection of a device suitable to fulfill the required switching functions is based on the characteristics of the load. The most common current rating for a device is ITH, which is a thermal rating for its capacity to carry a constant current value for an extended period of time without overheating. Whereas the loading of contacts by current and voltage when circuits are made and broken during switching is critical, with the making and breaking current for a resistive load significantly different to those of an induction motor. So utilization categories are used. With each load type having a different current profile during making and breaking operations, hence different utilization categories are prescribed for major load types for on and off switching functionality. A device can be suited for different applications, hence can have different rated operational current values for different utilization categories. A device's operational current for a utilization category may also be different at different operational voltages. There are categories for AC switching and for DC switching. For the sake of universal applicability, a switchgear device usually has ratings stated for several utilization categories for the different applications with different rated operational current values. Once we understand the utilization, selection of a device can then proceed based on rated operational voltage, UE, rated current or power of the load, and control functionality required. Utilization categories are defined for specific equipment types, being disconnectors and load switches, motor starters, control circuit devices, and transfer switches. In their respective standards for low voltage switch gear, 60947 parts three, four, five, and six. The test requirements in these standards define the test parameters for the individual utilization categories with the required making and braking capacity for each item of switch gear defined. Manufacturers are obliged to test according to these standards, which ensures the suitability of the tested devices for the respective application and enables comparison of products. The product standard for switch disconnectors, load brake switches and fuse switches is 60947 part three and defines their utilization categories for switching function of different load types. Category A is for frequent operation, whilst category B is used where the switching is infrequent or only occasionally required. The individual product standard for electromechanical contactors is 60947 part 4.1 and defines their utilization categories for switching capabilities for many different load types for their main poles. The auxiliary contacts of a contactor 
have ratings based on utilization categories for electromechanical control circuit devices. For motor starters and controllers with semiconductor switching rather than electromechanical are from product standard 60947 part 4.2 which defines the utilization categories for electronic soft starters and solid state contactors. Intermittent duty is used for soft starters where they have an internal or external bypass contactor. Six oh nine four seven part four point three is also for motor starters and controllers with semiconductor switching. However, this defines the utilization categories for the other load types, which aren't motors. The product standards for control circuit devices is 60947 point part five, with utilization categories and switching capabilities for push buttons, control relays, limit and position switches, defined in part 5.1. AC140 is an additional utilization with low current values for proximity switches from part 5.2. Solid state relays themselves are defined in IEC 62314. Transfer switching equipment is defined in low voltage switchgear 60947 part 6.1 with utilization categories for changeover of different load types and function. Category A for frequent operation and category B for infrequent or occasional switching is the same as part three. CPS devices are defined in 60947 part 6.2. These are a device which has one set of contacts which are used for control switching functions but are also used to open upon overcurrent protection commands, i.e. they are a combination contactor and circuit breaker. The utilization categories are similar to the functions assigned to electromechanical contactors. Thank you for joining us for this webinar. I trust you found it beneficial and helped in your understanding of utilization categories for different switchgear types.